Senator Harry Reid needs 60 votes to begin debate on his health care bill tomorrow night. Is he trying to buy one? A provision in the bill has language that would give $100 million to states recovering from natural disasters in the last few years. The biggest beneficiary of that language? Louisiana. And it just so happens that an important swing vote, Democratic Senator Mary Landro, comes from the Bayou State. Our next guest says something's fishy, and it's not the catfish. Jennifer Madsen is the president of the Baton Rouge Tea Party Movement. And by the way, we did invite Senator Landro on today's show. She declined. Uh, Jennifer, welcome to the program. It's Brian in for Neil. What do you make of this? Is this good politics, or is this a uh, bit of a payoff? This is absolutely not good politics. If we are going to craft responsible legislation, we need to look at the merits of the legislation and not focus on how we can add a little bit of sweetness here and a little extra there for each senator that's sitting on the fence. Oh, but what, you know, listen, Mary Landrew, she knew where she was. She knew she was an important vote. She will say, I'm sure, if she comes on the program, and again, she's welcome any time, that this was just doing what's best for her constituents. The $100 million is a one-time Medicaid payment to our state. It is not a long-term solution to our budgetary problems. We are taking a quick fix in order to ensure that cloture passes. We are not going to see long-term benefit from this. Why do you say that? Well, this is only going to be the payment for one budgetary year. What's going to happen years to come? We are still going to have increased Medicaid expenses based on the expansions in the Reed bill or the combination between the Reed and Pelosi bill, which passes. We are going to have additional expenses coming, and it's got to come from somewhere. You know, this just kind of coming out like so much is because the bill is so long, it's taking time for people to get through it. What has the reaction been in Louisiana? Our members are extremely outraged about this little addition into the bill. We would like to see the members of the U.S. Senate take their time. We have had health care problems in this country for a long time. We can sit down and craft a good, strong legislation that is beneficial for all Americans. Let's take our time and do it right the first time. We don't have to fix the problem this so Jennifer, weekend. You, you, your state has been hard hit, obviously, with Katrina. Why did deny the state these funds. If we're going to spend the money anyway, why shouldn't your state, which has gotten hit by so much in the last few years, get what's theirs? Well, like I said, it is a one-time supplement. We are still going to have to face these budgetary problems in the future. And if we don't start coming up with long-term plans, what are we going to do in the fiscal years to come? Jennifer, we appreciate your time. Jennifer Madsen, thank you very much. Thank you. All right.